atmosphere. He very, very laid back. There's no stress. The, the horses love him. It just, everything goes very easily. Hi, my name is Jeff Tucker. I'm an equine veterinarian who back in 1983 was exposed to the technique of dentistry, which I call horsemanship based dentistry. And it's something I became passionate about a little bit later in my practice. And I've developed something that I call the Tucker Technique of Equine Dentistry. It's nothing really new, but it's a system of learning how to do teeth to be able to be effective, to get the back teeth, not miss any sharp points in there, and work with almost every horse you get to without having to drug them automatically. I can't say enough good things about Dr. Tucker. He's professional, he's funny, he's kind, he's gentle with your horse. Really can't say enough good things about him. I would recommend anybody to try him. The appointments are easy and he travels and it's great. Our horses seem happier and everybody is happy with the way he works with our horses. There's no concern that he's being too rough with them or that he's going to do something that could hurt them in any way. He does not sedate unless absolutely necessary uh, and there is no speculum in the horse's mouth. First of all, he's a vet. He's gone to Cornell so he's got excellent credentials. So I like that. He's been doing strictly dentistry for probably over 12 years. And he understands horse behavior. He understands the client's concerns. And he takes a 360 degree approach to, his, to the process. The horses aren't treated as beings in our society. They're treated as equity and he has that mindset that the horse needs to come first and any person would benefit from that knowledge. What I liked best about the Tucker technique is how it related to the horses with the horsemanship aspect of it. He really understands how horses' minds work. He's a smart guy, he's got no pretensions about him, he knows what he's doing. Most of the horses that we do start off a little bug-eyed saying, hey, what are you doing? Your hands in my mouth, you're starting to float my teeth. But as soon as we take that pain away, bam, just like that, the horse say, oh my goodness, you're taking that pain away. Imagine I come up to you and I start taking your shoe off. You've never met me before. You're thinking I'm kind of crazy and you're about to call the cops on me until I take your shoe off, drop the pebbles out, put your shoe back on and you put your foot down and the pain is gone. And automatically you start to lift your other foot and say, hey, Doc, can you take this shoe off and get the pebbles out of this shoe? That paradigm shift is what we get to see almost every day in a horse. That's what good, responsible dentistry is all about. That's what we try and promote. The thing about Dr. Tucker is his way is a process. It's not an event where whenever you work with animals and anybody that knows me and has seen me work with animals, you always should make it a process. If you turn it into an event, nobody wins. People get hurt, horses get hurt, and the great thing about Doc T's technique, nobody gets hurt, the horses are treated as equals and not overpowered. He is very personable, he educates the client, he is wonderful with my mare who is very particular and doesn't let just anybody work with her. He doesn't have to drug her ever and he, he just does a wonderful job. The horses are not stressed out. They are, they're comfortable, they're happy, they get their teeth done, then they feel better and you've solidified your own relationship with your horse because you haven't put him in a situation that's traumatic. People are looking for this type of dentistry. They're trying to get away from the automatic drugging, the hanging the head, the jacking the mouth. They want to see horsemanship back in their barn. You have to be the advocate for your horse. If you're not going to advocate for them, no one will. So please take a moment and learn about the Tucker Technique Equine Dentistry and download the free uh, booklet that's online. Read it through and tell me what you think about it. Thanks a lot. <music>